In this video, we're going to talk about how to convert kilograms into grams and grams into kilograms. So here's the shortcut method. Well, first, you need to know that one kilogram is equal to 1000 grams. So that is our conversion factor. So therefore, if we want to convert from kilograms to grams, all you need to do is multiply by 1000. And if you wish to convert from grams to kilograms, what you need to do is divide by 1000. So that's the quick and simple way to get the answer. But for those of you who want to show your work, here's what you can do. So let's say we have 4.8 kilograms. Let's go ahead and convert that into grams. So start with what you're given, which is 4.8 kilograms. Now in the next fraction, we need to use our conversion factor. We want to set it up in such a way that the unit kilograms cancel, leaving behind the unit grams. So notice that we have the unit kilograms on the top part of the first fraction. We want to put that same unit on the bottom. So this portion of the conversion factor is going to go on the bottom. So I'm going to write one kilogram on the bottom and this part is going to go on the top. So by setting it up this way, we can see that the unit kilograms will cancel, leaving behind the unit grams. And so that's how we can convert from kilograms to grams. So because this number is on the top of the fraction, we're going to multiply 4.8 by 1,000. If this was on the bottom, we would divide by 1,000. So it's 4.8 times 1,000 which is 4,800 grams. So that's the answer for this example. For the sake of practice, try these two. Go ahead and convert 0.374 kilograms into grams and convert 0 0.056 kilograms into grams. So let's start with the first example. So the setup is going to be the same. We're going to put one kilogram on the bottom and a thousand grams on top. So it's going to be 0.374 times a thousand, which is 374 grams. So that's the answer for the first example. For the second, we're going to follow the same process. We're going to multiply 0 0.056 kilograms by 1000 grams over one kilogram. So 0 0.056 times 1,000, that's going to be 56 grams. So now you know how to convert from kilograms to grams. But now let's work backwards. Let's convert grams to kilograms. So let's say we have 4.5 grams. How many kilograms is that? So keep in mind, one kilogram is 1,000 grams. When you want to go from grams to kilograms, you need to divide but let's set it up first. So notice that we have the unit grams on top. This time, this part of the conversion factor will go on the bottom. The other part is going to go on the top. And the reason is so that we can cancel the unit grams because we don't want that anymore. We want the unit kilograms. So we want this unit to remain. So notice that the 1,000 is on the bottom of the second fraction. So this time we're going to divide by 1,000. So it's 4.5 divided by 1,000, which you can move the decimal point three units to the left. That's going to give us 0 0.0045 kilograms. So that's how you can convert from grams to kilograms. So here are two practice examples that you could try. Convert 16 grams into kilograms and uh, go ahead and convert 500 grams into kilograms. So let's start with the first one. We're going to write it as 16 grams over 1. Just like before, we're going to put the 1,000 grams on the bottom and 1 kilogram on top of the second fraction. These units will cancel, and it's going to be 16 divided by 1,000, or just move the decimal point three units to the left, 
and so you should get 0 0.016 kilograms. For the next one, it's going to be 500 grams over 1 times 1 kilogram per 1,000 grams. So it's 500 divided by 1,000, which is going to be 0.5 kilograms. So that's basically it for this video. Now you know how to convert from grams to kilograms and kilograms to grams.